All right. <clears throat> hello, hello, hello. All right, so we're in Ohio. I am on my way to my bowling league. And I went to go see Dungeons and Dragons this morning. Now, let's talk Dungeons and Dragons. I think that's like a role playing game or something like that. Oh, shit. This dude come flying off the expressway. <clears throat> Alright, so. I want to go see Dungeons and Dragons. And. I kind of. It was dumb. But I'm not. If I'm not mistaken, there was another Dungeons and Dragons movie that was made. I can't remember. But I'm pretty sure there was a Dungeons and Dragons movie made. Back in the 90s? I think so. When all the cheesy, like, He-Man movie and Mario movie. Anyway. <clears throat> this was kind of corny and cheesy. Uh, Michelle Rodriguez was hot, though. I hate that she's gay. I really would like to be her husband. I remember when she first came out, I think it was in a movie called Blue Crush. It was a surfboarding movie. At least that's the first mainstream movie that I saw her in. Yeah. Anyway. This movie was cheesy. It was corny. Um, I didn't really like it. The plot... The story... The story had me intrigued. I mean, it was kind of... I mean, you know, you go see movies enough, you know what's going to happen. But I think that they gave it a lot of thought. Um, yeah, I think they gave it a lot of thought. But <clears throat> the end, well, not the end. Well, you know what? There was a part towards the end I thought it was going to be over. And then there was a part in the movie I was like, man, what, is this a three hour long movie? Let's see, it was started at 11.15 and I got out at once. I think it was like more like an hour and 45 minutes or something like that. But it seemed kind of long. There was a part in the movie, uh, the fight scenes, obviously the fight scenes are uh, not all that great. I'm, try I'm trying to find something good. I'm, I'm trying to save the part that I like. I just tell you, it brought me to tears. I actually started having, uh, uh, I started shedding a tear because the end was he did all this to bring his wife back, which was her mother. And but Michelle Rodriguez was more of a mother because she was a, around when the girl had memories. So the girl didn't re didn't know anything about her mother. So when Michelle Rodriguez died. He had a choice to bring her back to life or his wife. And he brought Michelle back because even though he wasn't romantically involved with her, it was for his daughter's benefit because she wanted her back instead of her mother that she never knew. So, I, yeah, I shed a tear on that. And it was kind of like, oh, um, <clears throat> I would like for them to make a sequel. Because the Dungeons and Dragons movie, you know, I think there's a lot to be said with that. And then it, it reminded me of the old cartoon and the video game of them going in mazes and picking up chests and picking up things like that. So I like that idea. It brought back some childhood memories. But uh, I, I think they can do a lot more with this. Um, I was kind of expecting it to be this. Um, <clears throat> what do I want to say? Like Lord of the Rings type stuff. Like a more serious story telling. Uh, but no, they chose the cheap, corny, kid friendly movie. So I get that. But from, um, I stopped saying, but <clears throat> I like big butts and I cannot lie. So, um, yeah. I've never played the game. I've ne I, I mean, I played the video game, but I've never played the board game. I had cousins, man. They were all into that stuff. They were into that fantasy world type stuff. I, I couldn't see it. 
Um, but yeah. So I give this a two. Two two trucks. Two trucks out of five. I know I'm all over the place. I'm not giving a good I'm I'm trying to focus on getting to my uh bowling league. Cause I went like four miles out of route because I wasn't paying attention to where I had to get off at. <clears throat> um there were, I can't remember, so Michelle Rodriguez, the main character, I don't know his name, and then you had the other guy, he's, I know, I don't know his name, but he plays uh, comedic roles, ah, I can't think of his name, so they had some name brand people in here, some name, you know, they had some, people, the people that they thought could carry the movie. I think if they reboot it, they should make it more towards what it really is like and not cheesy. That's what I think. That's what I think should be going on. I don't know. Do <clears throat> anyway, so that's enough for me rambling about this movie. Um, I did shed a tear. And, uh, yeah. That's it. <laughs>